Hello everybody, welcome to my channel, I'm Felix and you're watching For Sense Sake. Today I am reviewing and talking about and comparing Jupe Go and Jupe on Ice. Well, before I go any further, let me just clarify this. I don't care how you call it and I'm quite sure that the organization, the company that makes this tube beauty here also don't care whether you call it Jupe or Yoop. Because let's just look at here. It's Joop, or Yoop, if you like, um, and there you have Om, which is a French word for male or man, and then you have Ice, which is an English word for ice. Then on this one we have Joop, or Yoop, if you will, and then we have Go, in English, Go. So, it doesn't matter. In English, it is pronounced, most of people pronounce Jupe, but you can say Yoop if you want to. But anyway, let's talk about these two fragrances. Okay, both have sweetness or a sweet smell, a woody scent, a woody, earthy fragrance that plays up in your mind, and they are both strong scents. However, Jupe Om Ice is much, much stronger than Go. But before I carry on talking about them, let's just show the box. I'm going to put them aside. So we have the boxes. Why are we talking about boxes here? Because I really care. I care about the packaging uh, because it shows to me how much effort the um, organization, their designers put into developing the product, not just the fragrance itself, but also the packaging. Jupe on Ice is a quite simple box, as you can see, not much to talk about, very simple, but workable, like one would say. You have the name there. Then you have Jupe Go. This one, however, is very glossy. You can see there is an exclamation mark there on the other side as well. Both have at the bottom uh, the code of this product and uh, a little bit more information about it, but not much to say. But I have to say that Jupe Go is much more stylish. Okay, the box. Very well. Spoke about that. Now let's go back to the uh, bottles. Just gonna grab them. Here we go, I'm back. As you saw um, on the box here, Jupe Go also has the exclamation mark kind of dented, marked on the bottle. And just put this one over there. Let me just show this first. Uh, it is curvaceous, it is sleek, it is smart, it is green. There is a tint of green on the glass as well, which makes the liquid, the uh, fragrance, look like even more green. Uh, although it, I think it is green. It is beautiful. Can you see the curve there? It is Gorgeous, I have to say. A lot of thought put into here. Um, this sprayer here is metal, very good. I like to test the spray. I like to have it opening up into the air in tiny minuscule droplets. And then that sprays all over. So I know I'm getting a lot of the product, but in a good way, not like being just thrown in a bucket of water but it comes and it spreads all over. So let's just see how it goes. Yeah, it's not very strong, but it is strong enough. Once again, I can see the droplets. Yeah, uh, I've seen better sprays, I have to say, but it is very good, this one. The fragrance, well, I can smell sweetness, woody scent also there's I don't know I may be wrong here but there's some fruity smell as well well I'm just giving you my judgment and my review based on what I smell okay and it is pleasant it is a strong scent but not too strong not too much I'd say that you can spray it three times, even four times when you go out. 
Now let's look into the other one. Here we are. Tube on eyes. The bottle, yeah, also very smart, beautiful. It's like a half circle. It grabs well right at the palm of your hand. Feels good. The name right at the front. The um, top here is plastic. Um, yet this one, I don't know, feels like metal, but looks like plastic. Let's see the spray of this one. I'm gonna spray it with the other arm. Let's see how that goes. Oh, okay. The I think the jet, the spray of this one is much better than Jeep Go. Jeep Go was far too straight, direct. I didn't see that opening up in the air and I didn't see many droplets in the air. Whereas Jeep on ice has a much better spray, it's stronger as well. Once again in the air. Can you see there? Okay, the fragrance itself, the smell is much, much stronger though. I'd say that if you're going out wearing this, look, two or three sprays are more than enough. But what I smell here, I also scent this smell of fruits, a kind of very sweet smell. And there is some wood as well in it, like of earth, a little bit at the back of my nose going to the back of my throat. What I'd say is, when you're going out, you spray less of this, especially if you're going to stay indoors. And if it's winter, it's autumn, it's cold, it's raining, and you know probably the doors and the windows will be closed, well, well, spray once or twice, because this is quite strong and the reason why I said at the beginning that when I first came across these two fragrances I didn't like much is exactly because of that they are sweet and the sweetness in, in them can be quite overpowering dupe on ice much more than dupe go dupe go I'd say if you're going to stay indoors Three to four sprays will do, and um, I don't think that's going to be a killer. I don't think that's going to be a spoiler. I don't think people people will be opening doors and the windows because your cologne, your smell is taking over everything else. Do I like them now? Yes, I do. Do I recommend them? Yes, I certainly do. Longevity, according to my experience, deep on ice because it's stronger much much stronger actually um, it lasts longer about six seven even eight hours okay and dupe go according to my own experience uh, it lasts about five to six hours but by the end of those hours both they are on the surface of your skin uh, they are not overpowering at all go for it try it they're not expensive i checked online before i started this video i went on amazon and i looked at the prices i found dupe on ice for about hmm, it was about 1995 british pounds to 25 british pounds which would be about 25 to 30 or 30 to 35 US dollars. Jeep Go, however, was cheaper. I found for 1990, 19 pounds and 90 pence. Again, British pounds, which would be about 25 US dollars. But also I found on Amazon by different organizations selling different company, selling for less than 15 pounds which would be about 20 US dollars. So as you can see, it's not expensive, very affordable, so go for it. And always, as I say, look your best, smell your best, and be yourself. And if you want to see more reviews on this channel, don't forget to subscribe. I hope to see you on my next video. Until then, goodbye.